Hello, and welcome to week one of RIT 101. I'm going to try to keep this short, but there's a lot to cover. So if you've made your way here and you've clicked on this first link here, right there, then you're in a good shape because now we're you're through the toughest part. It says finding the darn thing. You're in content. That's awesome. You're clicking on the videos. If it says review, I try to give these primers. That just means it's something you're going to look at, right? And so make sure you just have a few minutes to, to glance at it. Review the course syllabus and do the syllabus quiz. It's a true or false quiz. Uh, the correct answer is true. <laughs> um, I don't want to give it away, but it's that you understand the syllabus. And that means that you understand my policies and how to contact me, right? That you've read it and you've understand it. And uh, that is sort of a requirement uh, before we move on. You, you kind of have to agree that you understand the syllabus. And if not, we have to have a chat. Discussion boards. I'm going to do something a little different for the first time in a couple of years. For a, a discussion board, probably each week, not all of the discussion boards, uh, I'm going to use Flipgrid. Um, you can sort of use the old prompt. I'm going to leave some old prompts in there in case you don't get comfortable with Flipgrid. You do have an alternative. Flipgrid is a little video um, system. So um, you're going to click on this link here, link to Flipgrid instructions. It's hyperlinked. It's going to bring you to um, a, essentially, it, it'll bring you, I think, directly to the topic. So introduction. So it should bring you directly here. And you are going to post, and there should be some directions in here. It's going to require you to log in with your FECC.edu email address. It has to be the FECC one. And then it's going to have where you can respond and it'll walk you through. And it's basically just recording a quick video. You just tell me, we're gonna see your face, you're gonna tell me about yourself, it's gonna be awesome. And then you post it and then you're done. For Flipgrids, there are no peer responses that I require. Um, I'm sure that there's an option in there, but I'm not all that familiar with it yet. So until I get more comfortable, there's no responses required. So you're gonna see prompt due Thursday at midnight. That'll be the same for prompt posts on discussion boards almost the entire semester. And then you're going to see if you require a peer response. No peer response is required. And so if you can't get Flipgrid to work, then use the discussion board normally. When you click on this discussion board, it'll have you create a post. You'll create your post. You'll post it. I'll see that as well. I really don't care which form you use. Uh, I think students will like using Flipgrid better. And so you have the option. This one is not a Flipgrid post. This is writing a poem. I'm not going to do poems on Flipgrid, so we're not beating next. And so for this one, there are two peer posts that are due by Monday. So you're going to come in, hit the create a new topic tab. You're going to put your post, your poem in by Thursday night and post it. So that way on Friday, all of the poems are there. And then between Friday and Monday night, you get to read a couple of poems, respond back politely and um, make your peer post. This is what most of the posts for discussion boards are going to look like for this course. But again, I like having some video where we get to see each other. It's gonna create a good atmosphere. So I'm choosing the lighter ones to do flip grids. You're going to read this I believe essays. There's uh, four of them. Another discussion board, same thing, due Thursday, peer post due Monday. Review some thoughts on words, another discussion board. This first week's really intense. I had to combine some weeks this first one, I hit you hard, but they're all really light, easy things. You could probably get it done in two hours if you're, well, now it's probably three or four if you really got after it. Um, and then you'll find our first assignment. This is going to be a little different. So discussion boards are one thing. So reviews are another thing, right? Maybe if you're just looking at it or you're doing the discussion board. And assignments usually always do it on Monday at the end of the week. These are usually the bigger writing assignments that I make you do. This one here is I have a little bit of writing in here. You're going to assess it a little bit and give me your thoughts. But you're also, because I'm combining two weeks, going to do a little pre-write. So a few hundred words um, where you start to think about events in your life, things that could make good this, I believe, topics. And you're just basically going to try to write it and take a stab at getting some thoughts down and seeing what sticks. So this is the first week of course. There's a few new things, kind of exciting, and I hope that you enjoy it. Let me know if you have any questions. Use my